Ever since my book came out, people have been coming out of the woodwork with false accusations like Robert Kardashian's ex-wives accusing me of not being faithful when Chloe was conceived. Not true. I know all the rumors are absolutely ridiculous, but Chloe tells me all the time that she's really against doing a DNA test. Would it make you feel better if we did a DNA test? No. Are you sure? I don't care either way, because I, my dad is my dad and my stepdad's my stepdad. Thank you. Even though Chloe puts on a brave face, I know that deep down inside, it really does hurt her. And it kills me that any of my children are hurting because of my past mistakes. And that's why it's so important to me that she does do this DNA test so that once and for all, she can feel and be at peace. So I'm just a little annoyed right now because I'm getting all these Google alerts about this whole, the paternity of Khloe Kardashian stuff. This story, it, it's just not going away. I mean, it's gonna take something that proves it false once and for all, in my opinion. Well, I feel like it's long gone, so. Okay, well, it's not. Okay, well, everyone will forget about it sooner than later. Chloe, why wouldn't we just do a DNA test? Once and for all, we have an answer. Like, this is the truth, Sometimes done. I don't need an answer. It Go concerns you, Bye. what? What I need from you guys is just your permission for this doctor to come into the house and swab your mouth, and then he's gonna- But if Chloe's not involved in this, I don't understand why we're doing it behind her back. Because she's already said, no, I don't want I don't want to know. know. I don't want to know. know. I'm fine. Dad will always be my dad no matter what. That's I don't no even want to know. That's no way to go know. through life. But you somewhere know that your deep in her your heart, father. she does question it. I mean, she called me hysterically crying, going, please just tell me I know you know. Right, I just don't want it to be a big secret and shady. Like, there's no reason she needs to not know about this. Court, I just need your blessing, and I need you to say yes for the test. Chloe, whether she admits it or not, might feel so much better after knowing the truth. But then part of me also feels like I would want Chloe's blessing before I went and did something like this behind her back. So I really just don't know what to do. Hi. Come on in. I'm Dr. Daddy. I'm here to see Chris Jenner. Or I'm Chris. How are you? I have no idea what Chris is up to. But as usual, I'm always the last to know. The Why doctor, is this doctor here? Because Why? we want to do a test that proves that Robert Kardashian is Chloe's real dad. Oh, please. I know. Chris, 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 Chris. No, Chris, no, Chris, no. Come no. Here. no, I got to help. You're just bending to the tabloids, honey. No, I'm making Chloe feel better about herself. Oh. That's what I'm doing. She's fine about herself. I really think Chris has gone too far again. The reason this subject is even talked about is because it was in her book. I mean, she's got to let this thing go. I don't think she needs to prove anything to Chloe. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Take care, folks. We've all agreed to do a DNA test. This is just yeah. dumb. So. It's not stupid, and it's you do care. It's not stupid to you. You're the one who wrote it. You had an affair yeah. about however many years ago. It was 25 years ago, and I wrote a memoir, OK? And when memoir. you write a memoir, you have to like t tell your life story. Memoir. And what most people want to know is why I got divorced from daddy. So I told my story. There's well, nothing wrong the, with that. It's, that's what opened up the floodgates, the age, the where No, what age. opened up the floodgates, Chloe, if you remember correctly, is two of your dad's Ex-wives. Mom, watch your mouth Shut in front of my son. Drunk? Okay, no, I'm not Calm actually. Down. I'm angry. Because Calm you're blaming down. this on me when it wasn't I'm me who started this it rumor. It was all, uh, two other <laughs> that you are like even considering that their information be correct when they're just out to First get of all, press. I'm not blaming anything on you. Then Relax. why wouldn't you just Stop. want to get a DNA because test and put it to rest? To. Why? Leave me alone. People are out there saying that like Mom, your dad I don't isn't care, your dad. But I don't care what they're saying. Because everyone's calls me fat. Do you want me to go get lipo? No one's gonna help me out. If I don't want to do something, you're, no one's gonna help me out. I heard that pain in your voice when you called me that morning and I know it was But I'm pressed. over it. Yeah, but over it or not, there's somewhere in the back of your mind I don't, that... I don't care, and I don't, I'm not doing this. This is Dr. Teddy. Hi. Seriously, my dad is Robert Kardashian. My other dad is Bruce Jenner. 
If you f***ed other people during the same time and you do not know, go on Maury. Like, I don't care. Don't mean any disrespect, but I don't want to take a test, and I didn't know this was happening. Oh, no worries whatsoever. Sorry. No whatsoever. <laughs> Way to go, honey, on another good one. Let's hear it for Kris Jenner. I thought we've moved past this. This is so easily proved, but this is not what I wanted to come here and do. You guys get off my case. Seriously, it's annoying. The only way we'll get off is if you do it. Well, that's rude, because I'm not on your case about a lot of that I should be on. You think this bothers her deep down? You know, somebody said it, and in this world, once you say it or it's printed, it makes it real. I came in here and I was ambushed. We just want to do something for you. Like, this is but all about it's you. Not, it's actually not all about me. It's not yeah, about it is. It's, a, it's actually about mom she is cussing and yelling i don't know why no one was yelling back at her the woman is psychotic okay her delivery is awful but he's here and it takes two seconds literally i just wish she would just do it and get it over with and then it's done you know but i'm over it and she's not over it she's just not over it she's in there saying she's over it she laughs about it, but she's not laughing on the inside. That's her own insecurity, and I get that, but I think you inside feel like maybe I don't like that people are saying this about me. You know? It's a reflection on I both of us. I think she thinks, not... though, that you're like trying to sneakily do it for her, but it's really for you. My mom obviously wants her reputation to be clear, but she can't really articulate that to Chloe. I think that you're coming off so much like, this is all for you, Chloe. Everything I do is for you, when like you want it for yourself. I too. do want it for myself, and I realize you know? that, and that's why I can't sleep at night, because it's... Well, don't be so of, dramatic. Well, I can't. It's keeping me up at night. I feel like there's a little bit of a shadow of doubt with Chloe, and that kills me. I just want to be able to put it to bed for once and for all, no pun intended. I'm a little nervous to talk to you about this anymore. I don't say <laughs> whatever. really still going on. You know, I'm still not happy with my mom and me being ambushed about this whole DNA situation. If I wanted to get a paternity test, I would. I don't care about your letter. All I'm saying is, read the letter. Those are my feelings. If you choose not to do it, it's a free country. You don't have to do anything you don't want to do. Just read the damn letter and hear what's angry. in my heart. That's all I'm asking. Just you ask need them. a glass of wine. Yeah, maybe I do. I think I'm going to go get one. This isn't Just give me the respect of reading the damn letter. That's all I'm saying. Dearest Chloe, I fell in love with you and will always remember the look on Daddy's face when you were born. He was so happy and so excited that you were a blondie and gave Nana all the credit. Even made your grandmother, MJ, a little jealous, I think. What's important to me is for Chloe to get where she comes from. Daddy and I were so very close, and I know in my heart that he, too, would want to set the record straight. It makes me just so ridiculously sad to think that she wouldn't believe that Rob was her dad. I'm humbly asking you to do this for me so that we could find some closure to this very disturbing subject, especially since Daddy isn't here to help me himself. I love you more than you will ever know, Mommy. I love you. I love you, too. And I love your letter. Thank you. It was so nice. I love that part about Nana and MJ being jealous. When you were little. It took me two hours to write that letter. I just wrote what was in my heart. I appreciate your letter, and it means a lot to me. But you have to respect me, too. Let's just let bygones be bygones. I am an Odom anyway. I'm not a Kardashian anymore. So let's move on. OK, I'm, <laughs> I'm over it, too, by this point. I'm just tired. The whole thing's making me tired. So let's just forget about it. OK. I'm tired of fighting this fight. And if Chloe's OK with, you know, this whole situation, then I've got to be OK with it to move on and just go back to being a good mom. I love you. I love you, too, and thank Thanks. you for my letter. Thanks for reading it. OK. What my mom needs to truly understand is I don't have a doubt about who my family is. I have had a blessing of having two phenomenal fathers. And I don't need a DNA test to prove that to me.